Hello friends, today we make a smart irrigation system project. Now we start the project. First we open Tinker Cat. This is a Tinker Cat export. And now search the component Arduino UNO. Then drag and drop here. Another I search soil moisture sensor. This is the soil moisture sensor. Now we have to take a water pump. We have to use motor. This motor we have to use for the motor pump. Now connect the circuit. First pin is power pin. Connect to the power of the Arduino. Means 5 volt of the Arduino. I have connected the 5 volt. Put the black. And second terminal is the ground terminal. Connect to the negative of the Arduino. This is the negative terminal. Connect to the negative. This is the negative. Then we have to use black. This is a positive. Then we have to make a color red. Now, this is a signal pin. Connect to the any digital pin. I have connect to the 3 pin of the Arduino. Change the color also yellow. And now the connect to the water pump. In any terminal, you have to connect any digital pin. Any terminal connect to any digital pin. And second terminal of the motor connect to the ground of the Arduino. This is the ground pin. Now circuit is completed. Make a code, click on the code and delete this code. And first we have to create variable, create variable, soil moisture sensor. We have to use underscore, don't use space in two words. Soil moisture underscore sensor. Then click. You can see there is three block is generated. We have to take soil moisture sensor. And go to the input block, soil moisture sensor, connect to the digital pin. If I connect to the analog pin, we have to use, use read analog pin. I have connected digital to so read digital pin. Digital pin number 3. And go to the output block and take a print to serial monitor. In the hello world, we have to put the variable soil moisture sensor. Now start simulate and click on the serial monitor you can see the value if the soil moisture sensor is in wet dry condition then value is 0 if the soil moisture sensor is in dry condition then value is 1 we have to make a condition if the soil moisture is in dry then motor on if soil moisture is in wet the motor off go to the control block and use if else block and go to the math section and use this block. In the first block, we have to put the variable block, and second, we have to give the condition equal to zero. Zero means sensor is in dry. Go to the output, take a print, another set pin. Now, what is connected to the nine pin? Put the nine and high. Here we connect the nine, and here we put the low. If condition execute, then move to 9 pin is high. If condition not execute, 9 pin is low. Now start simulate. You can see motor is operating and serial monitor is value 0. I have also put the value 0. If sensor is in wet dry condition, when I sensor is in wet condition, motor automatically off. Means the soil moisture is in wet condition, then motor automatically off. The soil is dry condition, the motor automatically on, means water is automatically flow. If not flowing, then sensor is in wet condition. Now stop it and go to the block plus test. You can see this is a test code, you can copy it and use in the hardware. If you have any problem, you can comment also. Thank you all friends.